Hey guys, I'm back! And just in time for the final episode! <laughs> you know, I've been thinking. Mega Man really is a stupid name. I'm seriously thinking of changing it. Oh? To what? I'm thinking Rock. Then we'd be Rock and Roll! And I could call you Rocky! And I could call you Rollwinkle! No. Well, it looks like the island's safe now from pirates and genocidal girly men. I guess it's time for us to leave. Oh, no. No! What's she doing here? Hello again, Mega Man. It's been a long time. It's been like three days. Must you leave so soon, Mega Man? We were just beginning to get to know each other. Um, well, you see... I'm afraid it's quite impossible, Amelia. You see, we're the restless type. We have to stay on the move, braving new frontiers and seeking out new adventures every day. We also have some loose plot threads to tie up. Ha ha ha! Let's get out of here, Mega! I think I hear sirens! I'm going to miss you. I don't think it's mutual. Um, hey Amelia, I have a very special surprise for you, but I need you to close your eyes. It's a secret. Oh, really? <laughs> Alright. Ooh, I wonder what it is. Oh, I'm so excited. Look, Roll! The people of the island came to see us off! Come back here, jerk face! Our city is still in ruins! You ruined my credibility! You never paid your parking tickets! My toy collection! My boat smells like apricots! I hate apricots! Despite the fact that he dropped a police car on me, I for one am sad to see our hero leave. Maybe my medication isn't working. I anymore. can't hear you! You need to speak louder! Goodbye! What nice people. Maybe we'll come back and visit them again someday. Mm, maybe. So I guess this is the end. Yep, looks that way. This game left so many unanswered questions. Like, who am I? Who was that mysterious guy? And what dark secrets are locked up inside that monkey? I wonder what the next game will be like. I'm sure they'll be awesome. An epic adventure, spending half the world leading up to a climactic final battle for the survival of the human race. Yeah, and hopefully lots of plot exposition cutscenes. And even more love triangles and romantic confusion and awkwardness. Ugh, please no. But I'm sure it will be great, no matter what. So, is it here yet? Nope. How about now? Nuh-uh. How long is this going to take? Let's see, this game was released in 1997, Legends 2 release date... 2000?! Three years?! Uh, hey, it could be worse. What could be worse than waiting three years for a sequel? I guess we'll have to find some ways to pass the time. Hmm, maybe I should start writing fanfiction. The ocean. The endless frontier. These are the voyages of the airship Flutter. Its mission, to explore strange ruins, and to seek out new treasures and civilizations. To learn the secrets of Mega Man's past. Probably to boldly go where no digger has gone before. My wife and child may have abandoned me. This reporter may have put a restraining order on me. And my shop may have been closed into a snake infestation. But fear not, my loyal followers. My resolve is as strong as it ever has been. Hello, my name is, uh, Hannah, I guess. Um, my favorite color is blue, and I enjoy flying kites and eating Italian food. Yeah, can I start over? You know, we didn't have these fancy Pokemon cards and Game Boy colors back then. Rocks and twigs were our Pokemon. Maybe the occasional stone knife or bear skin. Those were like legendaries back then. And the tournaments could be brutal, and scary, and hospitalizing. Well, apparently there aren't any polar bears around here. So it looks like my dreams are a bit unrealistic. So instead, I want to go to the moon. I heard there's one underground. Isn't that right, Mr. Flower? I love you too, Mr. Flower. I've got this great idea for a new show. It's a reality show where we take 10 people with a range of backgrounds and personalities, put them all in a room with the Sharoku Rusu, and see who comes out alive! Oh, the drama that will ensue! I can't wait! Welcome to Stripe Burger! We have burgers! And... Stripes! Yay! 
way! Well, we managed to survive this time, but next time we'll be the end for us all! The Dragon God of Ammo Pants is coming, and his totally hot mistress is gonna turn us on to scrambled eggs! The Junk Shop Man said so! It must be true! Everyone's gonna die! Die, I say! Die! Hey, where are you going? Yar, there they go, flying off into yonder sunset. Shiver me timbers, can't this bucket go any faster? Diesel, just because we're on a boat, that doesn't mean you have to talk like a pirate. And no, it can't. Arr, tis a pity. But no matter, for this gold doubloon is a fine booty. Who would have thought that such a scurvy purple land lover would be having such a fine treasure? Aye, nothing to worry about, lads, for we shall live as pirate kings! Yar! Oh, a pirate king! Oh, alright. You know, one thing's still bothering me. The air battle. How did we survive that? Not only did the Foker Wolf explode, but we fell thousands of feet. It's almost as if something intervened on our behalf. That's right. Who said that? It's me, the narrator. I'm the one that saved you. Wait, does that mean you're like a god or something? More like an ascended, all-knowing being with non-interference rules. Have you ever watched Stargate? It's pretty much like that. So, if you can't interfere, then why did you help us? Are you kidding? I love you guys. You're the best characters in this game. I wasn't gonna let you die. Wow, that's really nice of you. But if you broke the rules, then what's going to happen now? That's for the High Council of Narrators to decide. I have a feeling they'll let me off, though. Seriously, any one of them would have done the same. Except for Kyle. He's a jerk. Great! Hey, could you use your superpowers to put us on the nearest island? This boat is seriously a drag. Sorry, I can't risk interfering if your lives aren't in danger. Besides, Bond seems to be having fun. Ah, the... Hmm. What if I dangle number 13 out the window? Then a life would be in danger. Come here, little guy. Get away from me. Hey, it doesn't work Come like on, that. Grab his legs and help me pin him down. I refuse to take part in this. No, seriously, guys. I'd be in a lot of trouble if Sir Bob was Exactly. In. This is exploitation of your popularity. If you're not careful, your role could be downgraded. Oh, stop squirming. This was a triumph I'm making a note here So much fun it's hard to say how great a time I've had here The master system Destroys what it must, it always has For the good of all the earth Except the carbons who are dead But no one is perfect, everyone makes mistakes I got beat I was cooked like a steak So the carbons live on And my body is gone But don't worry, I am still alive The first game is over I'm feeling so relieved right now A psychopathic android tried to kill me I kicked him to pieces It felt pretty good, I will admit As he burned, I smiled because I was so glad he was gone Now that monkey data makes a beautiful mime And I'm glad he showed up just in the nick of time For he saved everyone, and he made that satellite run and without him, no one would be alive. Ha ha ha! You tried to delete me. I give you praise, really good try. But you forgot to empty the recycle.
recycling.